Good morning, Stephen S. Wynn here with Connect to Hope, connecting on the road to full joy. This morning I am continuing my week-long adventure in making praise to God affect my daily life. And um, today I want to complete the sentence with the words God is in it by saying this, God is so intentional in making a way for me to be saved, making a way for me to be restored to the life-giving presence of my Heavenly Father. I was reading in a book called The Story of Redemption, Chapter 5, The Plan of Salvation, uh, just this morning, just a few moments ago, and it really struck me that when Adam and Eve sinned and doomed the, the human race, including me, uh, Jesus had a, uh, Jesus approached his Father in heaven. This is before Jesus came to this earth. And uh, Jesus approached his Father, and the author says that he, uh, Jesus went in to the bright light that uh, surrounded the, the, his Father. And so here we have two individuals, uh, Jesus approaching and coming into close converse with his Heavenly Father. And together, they formulated the plan of salvation. And uh, the book says that Jesus went in three times to, uh, to converse with his Father. And the third time, when he came out from his Father's presence, it says his person could be seen. Now this is very interesting uh, and probably content for another video, but uh, apparently Jesus' person could not be seen before he went in and conversed with his father about the plan of salvation. But just imagine, I mean, wow, my heavenly father and his son Jesus Christ were so intentional in saving me, in making a way for me to be restored to their presence. And, I mean, how do you say thank you for that? Well, I, say, I can say thank you for that probably most effectively, most meaningfully, by how I live today. Uh, not by anything I could say, but how I live, how I react to every situation, and how I respond when I'm treated unfairly. And so I need Jesus Christ, God's only begotten Son, to abide in me today in order to, in order to thank my Heavenly Father and His Son Jesus for the plan of salvation.